In this video, we're going to show you how to use a micropipette and to prepare sample R1, which is your first dilution. This is a micropipette. As you can tell by its name, its function is very similar to a pipette. However, it's really good at delivering very small volumes. If you can see right here, that is denoted as a thousand microliters. So if you convert that, that is 1.000 milliliters, okay? Now how to use a micropipette is that there's actually a button here you want to press that goes down twice. There are two stops for it, and you can actually hear it. We are really quiet. I don't know if you could hear it, but you, you can see my thumb going down to the first stop, and then further down to the second stop, going back to the first stop, and then going all the way up. So in order to use a micropipette, first you want to do is you want to grab a tip over here. So now you can see that there's a tip attached to the micropipette, and then you want to go down to the first stop, like this. Next, you want to draw up your liquid slowly. And the reason is that if you draw the liquid up too quickly, it will shoot into the micropipette, and that might damage the device, and that would be really bad. So once you have it loaded up, you're going to grab your target container, which in this case is a cuvette that we pre-labeled, and we're going to deliver the liquid again slowly. And at this point, you can see that my thumb is to the first stop. I'm actually going to press it to the second stop to expel everything out. Unlike the pipette where there's a little bit of liquid inside, these are actually designed so that you press to the second stop to expel everything out. And now we have our liquid in our cuvette. And then when you're done, you want to grab the tip and there's a button right here and you want to eject the tip into a marked waste container.